The Iranian parliament has agreed to set up a special committee to take a fine-tooth comb to the nuclear deal. The decision comes after Foreign Minister Javad Zarif presented the agreement to MPs, seeking to calm opposition from hardliners who consider it counter to national interests. We never claimed that the deal is completely to our benefit. A negotiation is a give-and-take process. Certainly we've had some flexibility and leniency, but that was planned. Everybody knows what matters most is the final result. The UN Security Council unanimously approved the deal on Monday, but included a provision to reinstate harsh measures if Tehran reenedges on its promises, an amendment which has irked some. However, the spokesperson for the National Security Committee explains that overall the parliament has a positive interpretation of the deal. He added that there are some issues and problematic points. The parliament technically has the right to reject the deal, though it's unlikely they would act against it after it won approval from the supreme leader. Our correspondent said Zari's mission at the Iranian parliament was no easier than his mission at the Vienna talks. He had to cast clarity upon all ambiguities but also convince hardliners so that the deal could make it past the final hurdle.